The officials there at center, and I think we are about to get this one underway. Puck is dropped to that hockey. Chikrin's taking it from his own end. Moves it on over to Rust. Takes the pass. From the right side, they gain the zone. Gets a hold of the puck here in his own end. Moves it to the offensive zone. The Avalanche have the puck in their own end. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Elliott. Kadri is usually scouted before any key matchup because he's a special player and a good point getter. McKinnon's ankle breaker zone ability is when he deeks at top speeds to create grade A chances. I'm expecting one of these two players to give their team the edge tonight, guys. Back to you. The Coyotes move the puck in the defensive zone. And that plays offside. Oh, getting a little cheeky there. Chickering's looking around for somebody to fight. He's going to have to go and fill the dance card somewhere else. Well, it's going to be a couple of penalties called on this play, James. Uh, offsetting penalties, no power plays will result. McCarr is known for his great skating, especially when turning. That's his elite edge's zone ability, and he's able to make better plays when he carries his speed into his turns, guys. Arizona's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. Out front! Oh, what a stop by Domingue! They work the puck into a scoring spot, get a pretty good chance on goal. They just can't find a way to finish it off. Great reach with the poke check by Girard. Colorado's got a hold of the puck now. The Coyotes get a hold of the puck in their own end. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. And that pass can't connect. From center, they get into the attacking area. Here's the pass. Doesn't go. Timmons plays it now. Can't connect on the pass. And no luck on that pass attempt. Slides the puck across. Right side set up ahead into the middle of the ice. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. He looks deep to Makar. Moves the puck along the half wall. You'll need more than that to beat him. Oh, devastating collision lined up in the railroad tracks. Goes full circle with the puck. Shot right in front. Big time saving goal as he gets all of it with the stick. Sharp reaction save. This shift is never going to end. They keep the pressure on. Great reflex on display tonight on his part. Oh, there's one more. Ten seconds. Yeah. So good. A couple of quick stops to keep the puck out. Into the attacking end. Players tell us all the time that they don't know where the next milestone is. That's garbage. They know when they're one goal away from a plateau. I think he's looking for it here. Counts on the attack in the offensive zone. Landeskog sliding the puck behind the net. Oh, tremendous athletic reflexes there with the toe stop. Taken by Johnson. Carries the puck inside the neutral zone. Move to the middle. Just can't complete that pass. Oh, he's got the right play in mind. He just doesn't execute the final pass. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. The game is still scoreless. Arizona's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Goligoski's got the puck in his own zone. The Avalanche have taken possession along the wall. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. The Coyotes gain possession in their own end. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Capobianco's got it into offensive territory. Denies it in front. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Here in the back half of this period, still looking for our first goal. Spets has won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Arizona's got a hold of the puck. Here's a short pass to Spezza. The Avs get a hold of it. Shoots it. Oh, target! 
Taken along the wall by Johansson. And he takes a shot. And there's a great save by Elliott. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Magnus got it behind the net. Change it up! Arizona's got control of the puck. Great use of the stick at center by Kobobianko. Driving right to the front. Nice save from point blank range. Uh, he's going to feel he missed one there. You don't get many chances that clean. The goalie turns it aside. Some last second communication before both teams get ready to drop the puck here. Colorado's won the faceoff. And that's picked off in the defensive end. Takes the feed. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Great read with the stick. Down the right side and into the zone. Quick feed to Comper. Into the corner now. Colorado's got the puck against the wall. Bristol wow. scores! Gabriel Landeskog! The only way he's stopping this one is if it hits him. As soon as the shooter went to shoot it, the goaltender dropped into the butterfly. He's looking around that traffic, hoping he can find it. The Avalanche have taken a 1-0 lead late here in the first. How does this change things now? Well, really, it shouldn't, James. I mean, you're not going to sit back. The lead's obviously just one. Get after it again. Four check. Try and make it two. Easy peasy right there by Elliott. And the puck's kicked free. Picked off. The Coyotes have it now. Knocked away with the stick by Taves. That's a textbook save by Elliott. Scooped up along the wall by O'Connor. Great glove save by Elliott. Doesn't lose his focus as he makes a couple of quick ones in a row. Landeskog's shot is among the league's best. And as a result, he's in the top ten in goals this season. Arizona's got it in the defensive zone. Moves it to Kadri. And that pass can't connect. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. Picked up along the wall by Yandel. Puck grab by Rust. Across the line. Arizona's got to hold of it against the wall. That pass doesn't go. And that'll put a bow on the first 20 minutes of action here tonight. We've got lots more still to come. Second period is just around the corner. Period number two seems ready to go. The teams are set. My broadcast partner, Ray Ferrar, was also set. Let's do this. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. Well, we've got over 20 minutes played thus far. Ray, how have you seen things? The Coyotes are going to have to find a possession game that looks a lot different than that first period. They chased it around, and as a result, they're chasing the game. And he passes it up ahead to Kadri. Blacks it into the offensive zone. The Avs gain possession. We got a delayed penalty coming up. That trip right in front of the official's eyes. Can't get away with that. And let's see what the definitive call is on the ice. Penalty killers are going to have to go to work now. They've got that one goal lead that they'll try to defend. Guys, this power play, as we know, is ranked toward the bottom of the league. But that's not for us to remind them of. That's the coach's job. They've got a huge opportunity here. We know they've been working hard. Let's see if they can put that work to the test. Oh, what a stop! Oh, wow! Again. This is a quality chance if the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. And they won't connect on that one. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Fires it into the offensive zone. O'Connor's got control of the puck in the corner. Arizona's got the puck in their own end. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Colorado's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. And they clear that puck. 
The Coyotes gain control of the puck. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. And that's knocked away in the defensive end by Taves. And they get the puck out of the danger zone. Arizona's gained possession along the boards. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. And that doesn't exactly go tape to tape. Arizona's looking to break out of their own end. And that's knocked away by McCall. Puck cleared from the defensive end. Colorado's got the puck in the corner. Nice zone entry on the left side. He grabs the puck here at the point. From point blank range. Scores! New game after that power play marker. At the very least, you don't want your power play to lose momentum. But when you've got a, a chance like this to even the score, you've got to come up big once in a while if you've got the extra player. They do. The power play clicks. And this game is tied. And now it's over to Keller. Off a stick and they can't connect. Over the line they come. An easy save by Elliott. Grabbed along the boards by Comper. Colorado sliding the puck behind the net. Quick stop by Elliott. Great reach with the stick by Landeskog. Stopped with ease. Yandel's got it in the defensive end. Nice puck check inside the attacking zone. Pushes it across to Johansson. Offside the call. We'll get a face-off coming up. Kadri's style of play will put him among the league leaders in hits every season. Nearing the midway mark of the period. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Slides the puck over. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Keller's close to pulling off a great move there. Just denied in zone. Here's a shot with the stop. He scores! There it is! His first in the NHL! Oh, you will never forget it. The first time you score a goal in the National Hockey League. to celebrate with the boys. Puck drop moments away here, and this crowd's still buzzing about what we just saw from the freshman. While they're expecting a lot from him, this is a little taste. And now it's grabbed by Chikrin. Long pass across the ice. Can't connect on the pass. Colorado's got the puck. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Glove save. Elliott's done it again. Another terrific save, and he's kept this game close. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. Colorado's been the better-looking team over the last few minutes. They'd love to build on this one-goal lead. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. The Coyotes will play it from the defensive zone. Read that perfectly with the poke check. And that's stopped by Elliott. Takes it in front. The Avalanche have the puck against the boards. Colorado's got it behind the net. The Avs will play the puck from behind the net. Denies him! These are frustrating. You don't get many chances like this. I thought he made a good shot, but the goalie, an excellent stop, beats the shooter. Some last-second communication with the D as centers get ready to drop the puck. The Coyotes win the draw. Arizona's looking to break out. Scrum along the boards, they battle for the puck. The Avs have it behind the net. Wow. They score! I like the way they stayed aggressive here, James, after scoring once. They didn't just settle the game down. They went after it again. Goalie just can't keep up with this. He's close to the net, but he's still able to have enough room to beat the goaltender. 
Colorado gets themselves a big insurance marker here in the second. I like the way that they've been playing, too. They've had control of the game. They've had the puck most of the night. And now that second goal gives them a little bit more comfort. Fisher's got it in the offensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Spezza. Pad save. He's on it tonight. Picks off the pass. Poked away in the neutral zone. Colorado's ready to go on the attack. And makes the routine save. Elliott's able to make the save, and on top of that, deflects it out to the corner. Picked up along the boards by O'Connor. Makes the glove stop. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. You can almost see the excitement on his face as he scored his first NHL goal a little bit earlier. Welcome to the NHL. Just here in the late stages of this frame, the Avs have all the momentum right now, leading by two. Stops him with the glove! Really good work. I like this chance here as they get the puck into a scoring spot. Goalie's just better on this time. Carter's won it in their own end. Arizona's got the puck in the defensive end. Colorado's got possession here in the neutral zone. The Avs gain possession along the wall. Play whistle dead offside the call. And both centers glide into the dot as a face-off set to resume. Puck is dropped and play resumes. The Coyotes have it now. Maintains possession. Good defensive effort to poke it away. The Avs take it along the wall. Blocked in traffic. O'Connor's working it around in the corner. The Coyotes get a hold of the puck in their own end. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Carter's got it against the boards. Good look. Not a good result, though. Yeah, they can't cash in if they can't get it on the net. Really good play to set up the chance, but nothing for it. And with that, two periods now in the books. Been a great night of hockey here on EA Sports, and we got the third period coming at you in moments. Alongside Ray Ferraro between the benches, I'm James Sabalski, ready to bring you period number three. Moment of truth for one team. Here we go. Third period is underway. Well, we've got two periods under our belts to this point so far. Ray, how do you see things? Arizona's had such a meager total of shots on goal. Predictably, they haven't scored. They've got to get more pucks to the net. The Coyotes will play it in their own end. Slides it on over to Chikrin. Puck picked up by Landeskog. Arizona's got control of it now from their own end. Great poke check on the reach. And now he angles it across to Rust. And that's broken up. Taken along the wall by Kadri. Puck scooped up by Rust. Oh, and that's got the crowd bussing after that stop. He's going to go back to the bench and want to look at that one again. He had enough time to really make a good shot. I don't think he quite got it where he wanted to. That goes off a twig. Now over to Keller. Keeps hold of the puck. The Coyotes will play it in their own end. And puts the body into it. A little bumper car hockey. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Hits an on-man rush. Two on one. They score! All you want to do is give yourself a chance. They were able to cut this lead to one. Now can they find another? More than half the period left to play. The Coyotes still trail by a goal here, but they are back into this one, only down by one. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Picked up by Johnson. Routine save made by Elliott. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Arizona's won the draw. Receives the pass. Quick pass to Carter. Nice zone entry from the left. The Coyotes played along the board. Nothing. Scooped up along the wall by Goligoski. Sends a pass over. Shuts him down. 
The Avs take it across the line. To his teammate. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. Quick snap. Denies him in close. Elliott's going to hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. Colorado's got it in the offensive zone. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. And that's turned aside. Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close. He, he scores! but that rebound came right back to him and he's able to settle it and put it into the net before anyone else can stop him. The Avalanche have added another as they make their way back to center ice. A two-goal lead. Looks like there's a lot of commotion on the bench there. The coach is still trying to give him the word to stay aggressive. The players are excited. That's a big goal for them. Slides the puck across to Ranta. Here's a short Danger, pass to Kraus. Oh, what a save by Domingue. Denies the shooter on that play. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. And that goes off a player. Simple stop by Elliott. Slides the puck down low. Deep inside his own end, right in front. Can he get out of pressure? And there's a power play opportunity coming up here. Let's see what the official makes for the final decision. The Avs are going to be shorthanded as they are called for tripping. Guys, this PK unit could not shut it down once already tonight. They've got another chance to do so right now against a tough power play here. We know they're ranked toward the bottom of the league, but it's something they're actively working on, and they're going to make the most of this opportunity. Stopped by the goaltender. He got a little piece of that one. And that shot gets caught in traffic. An attempt to clear the puck from deep inside his own end. He's got a step on a breakaway. Oh, to him with the paddle save. The Kings are on the schedule for the next day here. Yeah, it's fine for us to look ahead, but you really can't do that. You still got to finish the job at hand. Kadri's looking to win this draw and this man advantage here. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. And they'll go the other way with a great play by McCarr. All alone! But he can't get it to go! Clear it. Looks like an overthink to me, James. You got three things in your head and you can't quite pick anything. And you end up with no shot on net. And that's turned aside by Elliott. Here's a chance! Scores! A The rebound's there, he puts it away. Colorado's added to their lead here in this third period. It's been non-stop. I like how they've scored and then gone after the next one, James. They've had their foot down on the gas pedal the whole night. Can't get it to go. Landis Dunn's gaining momentum. And comes up empty. Takes a wrist shot. Just slide to the net. You can go games without a chance from here. Strong defensive effort. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Arizona's moving it into the offensive end. And that one's stopped. Goalie plays it up. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. And that goes wide. Picked up along the wall by Taves. Denies on the play. Elliott's going to hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James. He needed a cover there. Check in with our own Carlin Bade. Who had the better night in that head-to-head -head matchup with the Stars? McKinnon's been buzzing, and he's been rewarded here. His name in the box score proves he's had a stronger night, guys. Big-time save on a big-time shot. Elliott's going to smother it to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of the puck. 
Special teams so important. Can they capitalize on this power play here with a faceoff? Back Fair underway as he second. wins the draw inside the offensive zone. O'Connor's up at the box. The Avs grab possession to the puck. Arizona's coaches will not be liking that power play opportunity as they fail to convert and give up a shorthanded one. Well, now they got a bigger hole to dig out of. They give up the shorthanded goal. A sloppy power play, and they pay for it. And he denied that opportunity. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Arizona's got a hold of it along the wall. Grabbed along the board by Keller. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Doming. High quality chance, high quality save. In the final moments of this period, Colorado's got a 5-2 lead. The Coyotes win the faceoff. Nearing the final 60 seconds of this one. And that somehow stayed out of the net. Couldn't catch up to that pass. Looking to set up offensively. And not much on that one. Quick feed down low. Oh, and he completely muffs the shot. That pass doesn't go. And we've got... Oh, look at this. Three o'clock in the parking yeah. lot. Is it three o'clock already? Down they go. Ray, it looks like they're not done with each other down there. No, they're going to bark at each other on the way to the penalty box, but into the box they go. Time to sit down. McKinnon's known for making ridiculous dangles at top speed. That's his ankle breaker zone ability, and he's a player that's so entertaining to watch. Keep an eye on him out there if you can, guys. Slides the puck ahead to Kadri. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. Tried to connect the pass, but it doesn't go. I think it's a chance for a breather here as he hangs on and covers the puck up. Who, for the players or for you? Well, you know, I won't complain. Both centers ready to take the draw here coming up. The Avs get a hold of the puck in their own end. Colorado's got it in their own zone. They've got some momentum here. Oh, that's a big time save. I think he got it with a toe. Poked away in the offensive end. Chickren's lugging the puck. And he slides it quickly to Schmaltz. They go on the attack go, through center. Poked away in the defensive end. And there it is. This one's all over. The freshman sensation scores. The team wins. You didn't get that W when you scored your first goal, did you? No, I actually had four points. But I was on for four of their goals against, too. It's kind of a mixed bag that night. But you still remembered it. Oh, you bet. They're feeling good about this one, and here they come back out onto the ice, Razor. Unreal support from their fans. They salute them a thank you for their efforts tonight. Tick, tick, tick. The hours and the minutes continue to tick down towards tomorrow's trade deadline. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Thanks so much for gaming tonight.